Extroverts are reasonably straightforward people. Open and eager for new experiences, they remind us that life was not meant to be lived in a hermit shell. The possibilities are endless. There are places to visit and cultures to explore that enrich our lives and create meaning. Extroverts thrive on that sort of wonder, which is why it's not hard to be inspired by them and develop a little crush. Wondering if you might have a chance with someone like this? Here are eight subtle signs an extrovert likes you. One, they're actually shy around you. Contrary to popular belief, some extroverts might be shy upon initial encounters, especially if they caught the love bug. But as a cover-up, they might try to maintain their cool in front of you. This is hard for them to do, however, so take notes of some of the slips. They may act a little clumsy around you, laugh nervously, or stutter. Be friendly with them to break the ice. It's clear that what you think of them matters a lot. Two, they try to show off in front of you. Do they put forth effort in impressing you? Maybe when you're in close vicinity, they'll start to brag about their accomplishments. It's also a telltale sign if they recently discovered you're into a certain book or sport, so they may talk their ears off about that author or relevant sports event. Although it might come off inauthentic, obnoxious, or even shallow, deep down, they just want to get your attention. Consider it endearing. 3. They playfully challenge you. Extroverts love challenges. When they like someone, they may tease or stir up a playful debate just to see how you'd react. If this is something you experience regularly with them, don't take them too seriously. To them, it's all just fun and games and a way to bond with you. Who says trolling can't be a way to someone's heart? 4. They ask you a lot of questions. Are they endlessly curious about you? When an extrovert likes you, they won't just talk about themselves, but make a sincere effort to gather valuable information about you. They may ask you about your life goals, your favorite hobbies, or even what your go-to shampoo is if the both of you happen to be running errands together. Instead of seeing them as nosy individuals, know that this is a method they use to evaluate how much the two of you have in common. 5. They look at you. A lot. When extroverts are interested in you, they'll frequently stare at you. It's clear you've captivated them, so it's no surprise they'll admire you. They might even make excuses to touch you lightly, whether it means giving you a high five after you've done something well, or nudging you as they tell a joke. Many extroverts may do this in a friendly manner without necessarily having romantic feelings for someone, but pay close attention to how they look at you. The eyes can't lie. 6. They make time to hang out with you. Extroverts are usually open to meeting new people and expanding their social circles. For this reason, it may sometimes be hard to make plans with them because they have many events lined up already. If you find they always seem to reserve a spot for you, no matter how busy or active their lives are already, it's a sure sign they enjoy your company and want to strengthen that connection they have with you. 7. They open up to you. Extroverts tend to be pretty transparent already when they like to tell people about their stories and experiences. But if this person you know tends to only often indulge in small talk or keep things light, pay attention to what they open up to you about. Do they delve into deeper topics? or let you in in more vulnerable details, such as a past traumatic event or their current struggles. When they can be real with you, it goes to show they trust you. Eight, they wait for you to make the first move. Extroverts are commonly known to be the ones who make the first move, but this doesn't apply to every extrovert. Some extroverts, especially if they're female and traditional, may actually practice patience and wait for you to make the first move. They may have given you all these subtle signs, hoping you eventually get the hint. Now, the ball may be in your court. What's your next big move gonna be? Remember, don't allow your negative thoughts to prevent you from missing out on an opportunity to meet the love of your life. If you also liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. As always, thanks for watching.